friends. It is Saturday, um, March 18th. It is officially six weeks out today. And if you're new here, my name's Ashley or Ashley B. Lutz on Instagram. And yeah, I just finished my back and biceps workout. It was a really good one. 30 minutes of cardio on the stairs, 15 minutes in the sauna. And I had, I got eight and a half hours of sleep last night. Who am I? Exciting. And even more so, who am I? I woke up to a new low today. My last video was about my plateau. Um, and I still don't think I'm out of that plateau. I mean, like, this is, I, like, this is obviously like a new low. So I hit 119 on the nose. Um, and that's, I never hit a low today, which is weird. Like on Saturdays, um, my previous low on Tuesday was 119.6. So I don't know. We'll see. It could be just like a false, false reading. We'll see. But I mean, I'm, I'm feeling pretty good. Like energy levels are pretty decent. I do feel a little bit like zen today just like uh, I could just I could just chill so it was hard to like hype myself up a little bit for that workout but that is my only workout for today usually I do my newbie glute session with Renee today as well but he's actually running a powerlifting meet today so he and I are going to do our session tomorrow at noon which means I switch my back and biceps workout from I usually do it on Sundays but I did it today so tomorrow I'll do shoulders in the morning and then the newbie glutes Monday is usually a glute day, but I switched Monday and Tuesday's workouts as well and told Jamie that I would be doing that from like I'll be doing yoga and stuff on yoga and stuff yoga and cardio on Monday, which I usually do on Tuesday and then Tuesday I'll do my glute workout. So that's that glute and cardio. So the single glute glutes and cardio But anyways, I'm at grocery pickup for HEB right now. I did pick up Wendy's and shockingly, it's not for me, it's for my husband. If you know, if you've been here for a little bit, you know I pick him up usually a treat on Saturdays when I go to the gym. So, um, yep. But anyways, I'm gonna get these groceries. I'll probably just like take you guys along little bits and pieces of this week. Uh, it'll be kind of just, just little insights here and there. Um, let's see if I actually break this plateau. Let's see. And let's see if I can get these red spots to go away. I was bad. I picked. My toxic trait, I pick. I know not to do it. I know not to. And my husband is like, he's like, why do you do that? Like, if you know you shouldn't do it, why do you do it? I'm like, cause I am weak. <laughs> I don't know. I, not weird why we do stuff that we know we shouldn't do. Like, I don't have a ton of those things. Like, I'm usually, I'm pretty disciplined, but not with that. And also, I feel like you can just like see the like, the chillness, the desire to go back to sleep in my face. I'm okay with it because we don't have any plans today. We have plans tomorrow. Go to get our taxes done, newbie session, shoulders, parent uh, in laws are coming into town. So that'll be busy, but other than that, okay, I'm gonna go go to sleep. <laughs> I wish. Redo it. Look how bad that is. Ew. So I don't know. 
what I'll do, I'll probably do another one of the metallics colors because I haven't finished that collection yet. I'm thinking blue metallic. And then, yeah, uh, just chill today. Like, I wanna go to Target probably after my next meal. I'm being very strategic here with my meals. Uh, it's, it's 10.40, I will eat my next meal around noon, and then three, and then six, so, yeah. And by the way, today is a high macro day, hence the huge stack of bread. Sourdough bread, if you know, you know. Anyways, I just wanted to pop in, say I'm super thankful for just this kind of like self-care day. And going to Target, oh, and I'll probably go to Whole Foods too because they have um, their smoked kipper on sale. And smoked kipper is like so good with some crackers. Um, and I wanna pick some up because if it's on sale, I usually do. That's when I stock up. I'm, Kind of gross, and I like the smoked kippers and sardines. They're delicious. So, so or the sardines, I love it with a a sauerkraut and laughing cow sourdough sandwich, toasted, delicious. And then, yeah, the the smoked kippers with the crackers. So, anyways, okay. Happy Ashley checking in and checking. Okay, got my nail polish on. This is Hollow Taco, my favorite brand in Aquafoil. So yeah, it's pretty decent, I like it. Okay, Whole Foods run complete. Got some good stuff I'll show you in a sec. All right guys, the samples were out and about at Whole Foods today. And I was like, I, I was, it was weird. I was like, oh, I should grab one. And I was like, no, no, don't, don't, don't do that. <laughs> um, but anyways, I got lots of stuff on sale. I got some asparagus. I got some apples. I got six things of my kippers. These are the smoked kippers. They're so freaking good so good little joys in life um spaghetti for hubby and then let's do spaghetti for me which is this cassava pasta from jovial foods my oat bran that's where i get it um it's the bob's bread mill brand and then i hashtag treat yourself myself so i got this olive oil infused with tr white truffle yum so that sounds great and then something i'm interested to try is mct oil so both of those um weren't cheap but i was like this is my calling this like my because i told you guys in the last video i got a raise at, or not a raise um i will get a raise but that conversation is later um i got a promotion at work so i'm like promotion present <laughs> i'm gonna use that for the next month uh, and then i got this classic barbecue seasoning from noble made the new primal um because i use that in my hubby's meal prep pretty frequently so yep that's what i got and I'm very excited about it it's funny to me that I got all these oils because it's not like my fats are very high. I'm, not, I'm like 40 and 45 fats. Um, whereas like in the improvement season, I'm typically like 60 to 70 grams of fat. Um, but I've like found the joy in oils lately. Not lately, probably over the last like year and a half. I like, I don't know, maybe just like enhance a little bit, you know? And it helps me be less focused on like yummy fats I would say like the fats that like don't do anything for my oh sorry <sighs> yikes pulling out this and it made a terrible noise um but the ones that help my it's like help my insides so yeah and I also have um macadamia nut oil at home so loving the oils and once my fats get higher I'll, I'll use more more oils but even now I'm still finding opportunities actually to to use oils butters so um yeah i'm very i will say in prep right now i'm very picky about my fats i get my fats from bison salmon sardines um 
my seeds, I, a seed cycle, and I do sesame and sunflower, which I'm on now, starting today, or flax and pumpkin seeds, uh, which I prefer that combo better. Um, those Brazil nuts, no, those are basically it, and then like trace fats from chicken and stuff like that. And like trace fats from oat bran. Yeah, that's, uh, again, I'm, I'm pretty picky. It's interesting, I was thinking this morning, I was like, man, actually, because Jamie sets my macros in my fitness pal, so I like, I can, I just zero them out every day, and sometimes I forget what macros I'm on, and I was like, oh, I'm on 40 fat. I was like, man, I don't feel like I'm on 40 fat at all. Like, I feel pretty abundant with my fat still, so that's awesome. But if she cuts them down any more, then I'd, I probably wouldn't. I'm getting into like the, the zone where I don't have too many fats to play with, I would say, or like, because if I had extra fats, I would just do oil or butter, so yeah. Anyways, okay, I am off to Target. I got some goods over here. I did not find everything everywhere all at once, so I'm gonna go. I did, however, get lots of cleaning supplies that I did not intend to get, but we needed, so. Thanks. Okay. Again, not mine. Okay, I'm gonna go find this movie. I'm gonna find it. Look. Dang it. So disappointing. Ah, it's just so nice sitting here with my Sprite Zero. And I think next, my, it's 3.15 right now. My in-laws will get here around 4.30-ish, 4.45, something like that. I think they left at 1.45 coming from Dallas, so it'll be about three hours. And I want to finish this. Um, I want to play with some of my gym equipment and I just wanna like play around with it for a little bit. And then I wanna take a bath. And then I want to be done doing nothing for the rest of the day. Sounds like a great plan. Can't wait. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys what I got from my little mini Sephora haul. Um, so they had 50% off of some items. They got had 50% off of this um, Stila Stay All Day Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner. And I know for some up up upcoming competitions, um, I probably needed to renew my liquid eyeliner because I think I've had the same one for like like years so it's I think it's a pen style which is what I like so yay and then the other thing I got because 50% off and I was like okay is this still a um, eyeliner in shimmer cream and I like to put on the very inside of my eyelid um, like a white cream color so I think this will be perfect. And again, 50% off got me. So I'm actually gonna test this out. And I think at some point here over the next six weeks, um, between now and then, I do want to do a, I'll do like a chatty YouTube practice my stage makeup with me video, because I think that would be helpful for me and maybe you if you are looking to do your own stage makeup. I have, whoa, <laughs> wow, that jetted out there. Um, I've always done my own stage makeup and yeah, it turns out pretty nice. So I think I've got it down pretty well now, but I obviously need to practice since it's been a couple years, but yeah, here's the color. Yeah, so I'm gonna play with it real quick. Yeah, that looks pretty nice in the water line. Um, I don't know if you'll be able to see it. None. Yeah, it looks kind of weird <laughs> without any other makeup on, but anyways. So those two, and then got my stage makeup absolute favorite, absolute favorite lip color. It is Lolita by KVD, it used to be Kat Von D, and I, I skin love this color Ooh, it's a big one i only have the minis so yeah this color is mwah, beautiful on stage so it's like an enhanced 
it's just beautiful. It goes with everything too. And then I got a couple little samples, which is this milk uh, hydro primer and then some purple shampoo because it's blonde. Okay, now I'm gonna go do my abs, play in the gym, take a bath, and then my in-laws will be here. Okay, it is bath time. Good morning. I hit a new low. Again, 118.6. We broke into the 118s today, so. And my in-laws are here, and I haven't had breakfast yet, so. But I was able to sleep in until six again, third day in a row. Who am I? Everything I've ever known is now a mystery. <laughs> okay, well, we'll see if this uh, low trend keeps on rolling. My father-in-law hung my paintings, so very nice. And I'll turn you guys around and show you guys what it looks like on Zoom, which is why I have the Zoom background. So this is me standing and then me sitting. It looks like. Go down, down, down. Looks like that. So I think it looks really nice because you can see the chair. It's just right above. Beautiful, so exciting. Okay guys, it is almost 11 o'clock. It's uh, 10.53 and I'm gonna have my first coffee for the day. I had a decaf, but that was nothing. So I think I'm gonna have the, like a lower caffeine one, double espresso dolce. Ow. My hand. See ya. I'll do that because I have my newbie session here in just a minute. Not just a minute, in an hour that I did just eat, and it was so good. Oh my gosh, sauerkraut and sardine sandwiches are so good. Oh, they're so good. I have yet to have anybody tell me they've tried it, but tell me, you're missing out. It's very good. <laughs> but yeah, toast it with butter and put some sauerkraut and a little bit of salt on there. So good. next day it's Monday I matched my low from yesterday 118.6 what the heck I forgot to mention yesterday's low was actually after a high carb day or a high macro day when I had a low macro day yesterday but I had my newbie and that I almost always wake up heavier after my newbie but that's a combination of like newbie being on Saturday usually and my high macro day so Anyways, we'll see what happens tomorrow, but uh, yesterday ended up being so crazy. Like after my newbie session, I ran home, showered, changed, ran to the old apartment. We like painted some stuff real quick, um, put some finishing touches on it, turned in our keys, had our H&R Block tax appointment, which um, tears, because basically I have a restricted stock plan that I, I did catch out some of last year and it's like yeah we think that the taxes are a little wrong actually so some and so did the lady she was like all right the, the really smart lady left and we're like great okay so anyways we're gonna have the really smart lady uh call us back later this week and if needed go in the following week but anyways kind of craziness there are crazy drivers right now. Um, but after that, we ran straight to a place called Margaritas, and met my dad um, and my in laws were with us this whole time basically, except for at the tax appointment. So it was my husband and I, his parents, my dad. It was really fun. We stayed there for a couple hours, and then in this meantime, I had to like finish up like 5,000 steps. So I was like walking in place, <laughs> and I brought my food to the restaurant. My family all knows. They all know. It surprises me sometimes when they're like, you're not even gonna have a chip because it was a Mexican place. I'm like, nah, like you guys know that 
this by now. You know. You know. But anyways, it was a really good day. I ended up sleeping like eight hours again. Guys, I have slept eight and a half hours, three nights in a row. It was eight hours, eight and a half hours, three nights in a row, and then another eight hours. Five days in a row. So much sleep. Who and who who is this? This is not me in prep. That's so weird. So I'm enjoying it while it lasts because I don't expect it to last at all. Like good sleep on prep is uh, a gem. <laughs> but I'm feeling really good today. I just finished my cardio. Now I'm gonna go do my yoga and start the work day. Anyways, this is my little update. Hello. Whoa, my hair. Well, I gotta fix that. <laughs> just wanted to quickly pop in. I'm eating, but. I just wanna show you my office situation because yeah, I haven't showed you guys the entirety. So I'm gonna turn this around and you won't be able to see this, whatever this is. Okay, here's the situation. And I worked on some cable management. So I had all these wires sticking down below. And you can see I added a track right there, all the dots and then um, a power system right there. So I'm pretty proud of this. So I minimized the cables to two going down. That's my box of stuff, but yeah. I think it's looking pretty good. And this backdrop is just so pretty. It's not doing it justice, justice but it sparkles, so. Anyways, back to my lunch before my next call. Okay. Good morning, it's check-in day, and guys, I just had the most exciting check-in. I'll put in my videos and pictures here, but oh, I'm so happy, I'm so happy. And I woke up at a new low, 117.9, and I'm just happy. I'm very excited. We still have some pushing to do on conditioning, but like, oh, check-in lighting, Check. Feeling good. Check. A little hint of time. Check. Okay. Had to catch that reaction. I'm, I'm so excited. I haven't felt this excited about my check-in photos in four weeks. I think four weeks. <sighs> okay. Now I gotta hurry, scurry, eat, and go do my lips. Hello, checking in with my peas, bison, Ezekiel muffin with the laughing cow cheese. It is high carb day and, or high macro day. And Jamie responded earlier and she's very happy. She said, no changes. We just need to bring some more conditioning, which like a thousand percent agreed. Like I'm not done yet. <laughs> um, and she's hoping that we can feed into the show, but yeah, I'm very excited. Then I, I don't care if we need to keep pushing to the show. like. That's fine, I'm just, I'm so excited about today's check-in still, so. Yay. Okay, back, back to food and work. Go, go, go. I don't know if you guys can see that, but. Ooh, yo, gosh, I just like, literally drip sweat. I'm sweaty. 7.57 on Wednesday. I finished my uh, chest rear delts and triceps workout. I swear everybody was working chest today. That was like, I walked in and I was like, how are literally all the benches and all the like, all the incline chest stuff is taken? But we worked it out. I used dumbbells instead of the machine, which I haven't done in a long time and oh, so humbling. Oh, but it felt good. Um, it felt good. I wasn't my strongest, I would say, but like I had a really good connection. So, you know, take the wins. I slept pretty decent last night. Shockingly, I woke up 0.1 above my weight yesterday and that was after high carb day or high macro day. I feel like things are happening. I'm very excited to keep pushing this conditioning though. I'm very pumped. I just wanna 
want to come in with that backside like ready. So we still have five weeks, plenty of time. Um, but yeah, I think I'm going to wrap it up here. Um, actually, I might show you guys that we're getting our gym floor installed tomorrow. We have this like crappy foam right now and we want rubber because we're going to have some like legit machines in there and I want to be able to pose and not rip up the floor. <laughs> so that'll be installed on Thursday. I'll start my posing practice on Thursday. So maybe I'll end with a little bit of that. But as for the talking, I'm done. You're done with me for this video. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next one for my official five weeks out video because this is six. It's almost here. One more thing. Apparently, I just realized it's my three year work anniversary. And three years ago was the day I also started my first prep. So happy prep anniversary and work anniversary to me. So that's pretty cool. Anyways, okay. Now wrapping up and keeping on with season three of my bikini prep. Okay, new gym flooring. It's a little dirty, but yeah, it's, it's rubber instead of that foam crap. Yee.